I started uh, at a young age uh, tearing apart all of my models, all of my RC cars. Uh, I love pulling apart something and figuring out how it worked and finding a way I could actually improve upon it. I really felt that uh, when I learned about 3D printing, it could be something very powerful for me. I could actually take it and, and make my ideas reality. Being an architect, when I was first designing this printer, uh, it was my intention to actually be able to print architectural joints or details on the printer and test them out in the real world. You have right now people sharing models, sharing designs with users all around the world so they can print their own and they can take this model, download it. It could be a part for their car that they want to print out and use it as an upgrade. Right now, there's a, a, a large online community where people can share all of their designs, all of their products, and others can just download them. And we envision that this printer will be part of that community. We really want people to be able to modify or customize this printer and share those parts with other users. All of the parts in our printer are 3D printed, and this actually allows for easy modifications. The parts themselves bolt onto the aluminum frame system, and it's as easy as sliding in a, a T-nut and tightening a bolt. It's easy to swap out parts, it's easy to change parts, um, and it's easy to assemble. You know, you can assemble it yourself. When we were designing it, we felt had to have certain features. We weren't just designing a product to sell, we were designing something we wanted to actually use ourselves. The printer initially started as a, a large printer. It had to have a big bed. It's 16 by 16 inch bed allows you to print as large as you want, but yet you can actually print down to 75 microns, which is a highly detailed model. Once we decided that we wanted to have the bed size large, this immediately set the stage for other parts of the printer, such as the, the dual Z-axis, um, a powerful motor to move the bed itself, an integrated blower fan actually in the extruder which allows for your parts to cool quite quickly and along with that there's actually an LED lighting system so you can easily see what you're printing. Uh, it might seem like a, a funny standard little feature but it's actually very important to see what you're printing. The nozzle itself comes available in a 0.35 millimeter or 0.5 millimeter size depending on what you want to print and the whole extruder can easily be popped off and swapped later if you choose you want to print something different. Everybody's talking about 3D printing and it really isn't just for NASA. It actually has uses for everybody. You can 3D print everything from toys, uh, decorative designs, to prototypes for clients. 3D printing is practical, innovative, affordable, cutting edge, and quite frankly, just fun.